Alright guys, welcome back. We're about to begin some more of uh, GK San Andreas here. So we do have to go meet up Caesar here. He was saying there's some uh, races going down here. What the f Okay. <laughs> Weezy Moo. Man, where is this guy? Hey, I've been waiting forever, man. Where the hell you been? Sorry, Holmes. I had no idea when the race would be. Right. You just happened to show up five minutes after everybody else, huh? When the gasoline runs through your vein like the burning passion. You know when it's time to race. I think you're getting high. Oh, on that's that Tommy here. behind us. Hey, CJ, look. You haven't been to one of our meets before. Where are you from, friend? I'm from Grove Street Family, Los Santos. What's happening? Relax. This isn't a parade, pal. But you know, we gotta be careful. Wootsy Moon. But my friends call me Wootsy. How are you doing? CJ. Carl Johnson. Listen, out here we like to race for cash or pink slips. Race of choice. Get your car started. We're about to go. Good luck, Carl Johnson. There's something real strange about that dude. Be careful, CJ. For sure. Oh, about to begin, I'm fixing my mic here. Let us go. My hood just came off, but we good, man. Yo, what are you, what are you doing, bro? Broski. Yo, these guys. All right, we got you. Don't worry. My car's faster. Look at this thing. We took this from our girl. Yeah, <laughs> my man. There's, you know what? There's a GTA at the end of the day. Everything's fair. Everything goes. Oh shit, there's a like. Oh no, no, no. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh no, no, no. CJ, CJs. Holy shit. Oh, we done. That's right. I mean, that wasn't a good time frame. We had a. Uh... Drive with style, Carl Johnson. And I never mind losing to a guy who's willing to push himself right to the edge. As for me, I'm a man who honors his bet. Well, you've learned pretty fast with the police on your ass. Listen, it's best if we clear the hell out of here as soon as possible, because for some reason, the local police don't appreciate our noble sport. Yeah, thanks for the advice. Okay, I gotta go. Uh, you know what? If you ever find yourself in San Fierro, give me a call. Maybe we can do a little business together. Yeah, I might just do that. I guess that's our wake-up call. Nice meeting you. Wow, this is so bad. I cannot believe how badly Rockstar messed this up. Like, you can literally see the space through my man's bloody shirt, man. Like, what the hell? Rockstar, what you guys up to? Oh, we got a nice car right here. Did we win this pink slip right here? Oh, look at that. I got leather inside. We'll take it. Hold on a second here. Options. I just want to see the audio here. I'll put this up. A little, I'll put it up a little bit. Uh, Alright, hold on a sec. Alright, let's see how this goes then. Farewell, my love. Okay. Tommy Versetti. Damn, man, now what? Big! What? What I do now? Oh, so this is where you been, eh? This is how you repay my tenderness? Do you prefer the curves of some car to those of a real woman? Look, Catalina. 
You called it off, remember? Just business. What kind of a man are you? When I say just business, I mean that I love what you. What the fuck? When I say I know interested no more, I mean that I love wait. you. Wait. And hey, when I say that wait, I miss Catalina, you. Wait, Leave my car alone. I did this for us, for me and you. It's too late. I don't love you no more. I love another, okay? What? Then what the fuck was this about? I cannot keep my passions hold up. They need a release. That was a good release. Like hitting a man with a frying pan while he sleeps. This Carl? This is my new man. Are you jealous? Are you going to fight for me? Huh? No, no, I, I can take rejection. You are jealous and a coward. <laughs> now let's race! I gonna race our man Tommy. Crazy bitch. Yeah, this is his outfit from uh from the GTA 3. Okay, we're going for another race here. Oh my man, what you do? Serves you right. Damn. <laughs> Catalina. My girl oh what's this guy doing? You know, you're gonna you think you're doing something here. Well it's just my man. We're gonna. <laughs> oh, I don't think we hit. You. Oh, is this like a race back to, uh, like backwards kind of thing to the last part? It looks like it. You have a bad week, huh? Oh no, I'll this guy got ahead that. of us. Oh yeah, this this is basically back to. Oh, so it's just like back and forth. When I what? We don't get paid anything. We got nothing. We got mission passed, and we got a D to a garage. Yeah, if you guys, if you guys remember in uh, in GTA 3, in the start of it, uh, we gotta run, we gotta run, CJ, run, CJ, run, 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 run. What's happening? Hey, Carl, dude. Now I got the little mau mau you're after, but be careful, man. People are listening to us. I got a little green village up in the hills. Come and get it. Oh man, I don't know you. I don't know you. Prank caller, prank caller. Oh, we got on fire. Why are we on fire? My man, we, we might. Where is this guy hiding at? Truth, man. Um. Oh, he is all the way up there. Okay. Um. Okay. What we'll do is, uh, we'll kind of cut the. I'll kind of get over there. And I'll I'll cut off the video from there because uh, we kind of gotta go meet Truth, and we're getting burnt here alive, which is not good. But uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll cut off the video from here, and uh, I'll get over there. Yeah. All right, we have arrived on a little bicycle. To, uh, to what, whatever, whatever location, truth. Are you going to San Fierro? Peace. I've got everything you need, lone traveler. It's in the mothership. Back there. Thanks, man. Look, 
Here go your paper. Ah, the karmic circle closes. All is as it should be. Back to the egg. Ooh. Damn, man, there must be two tons of that stuff back there. What's that noise? Hey, that sound like a chop. Oh, man. Narks. You fucking rat. Dude, don't put that on me. You don't want to deal with Tim Penny. What's all this? Calm, brother. Panic paves the way to bad karma. Man. We gotta torch those fields. I only hope Kaya can forgive us. Ooh, let's go. Holy shit, this my man is... My man's on some... What is this chopper doing, man? Assholes! Right wing assholes! Oh, I don't feel too good. It's a cry of shame, ain't it? No, I mean, I think I'm gonna black out. Fight the ocean and you will drown, brother. Carl, man, we'll take the mothership and get our shit out of here. Go get her fired up. I'll finish burning and I'll follow you. The mothership. I always wonder if there's a way to get his car. One time, the older version, I kind of killed him here. And then I took his car, but... Um, what happened was, uh, when I eventually went back to my saved garage, it, uh, it wasn't there anymore, so... I don't want to do that because this is a pretty long mission. Go speak to truth. All right. Let's go. Let's get out our fist. Oh, that's his car. We got a chopper on our tail. We'll never shake him now. Hold on. I got a little something back here I was saving for a rainy day. Rocket launcher. Holy motherfucker! Where'd you get that? Found it in a bale of tie sticks. Shame, really. We're gonna make it into a lamp. Where is this chopper? They both blew up. Drive to the mothership to the garage and send Fierro. Okay, I'll do that. Oh, so this is like the second What'd city we're going to now. You better drive. I haven't driven in 15 years. You was doing all right? Yeah, then the fear hit me. Now I'm rolling a number to calm the waves. Shit, I better call Caesar. Hey, Caesar, no time to talk, man. I'm on my way to San Figuero, okay? I'll meet you and Kendall at that garage I wanted to race. I'll let y'all later. Not even a word from Caesar. Not even a... Okay, meet you there, you know. What's with all aluminum for you, man? Protection from mind control, dude. Mind control? Induction of images, sound or emotion using microwave radiation. Do you know how many government satellites are watching any citizen at any moment? No. 23. Do you know how many religious relics are kept at the Pentagon? No, I don't. 23. You see a pattern emerging here, man? Man, I'm seeing patterns all over the place. Get that smoke out my face. Oh, we're gonna go off-road? No, oh, this is the road. Okay, we kinda missed this turn here. Hey, this thing go any faster? Man, we got three tons of grass on board. The engine block is held together with a macrame hammock and it's running on 15-year-old cooking oil. Shit! Can you shoot? Shoot! I'm a hippie! The only thing I've shot is acid. Well, I heard about this dude snorting it once. Thought his nose was a kangaroo and the moon was a dog. Woo! <laughs> well, we're here anyways. Uh, this is San Fierro. Uh, we got our... Uh, we Jesus! Got... We screwed! When did you get this? 1967. <laughs> How you get around if you don't drop? I have an astral goat called Herbie. She's faster than most. But getting old. Yeah, whatever, man. You talking shit. And Piero. Oh, there she is, brother. San Fierro. City of psychedelic wonders. 
Man, I can't believe I ain't been here before. There ain't a better place to escape the man, man. Okay, Mr. San Fierro, where's the spot at? It's in Doherty, on the east side of Fierro, oh, between Garcia and Easter Basin. We need to go and uh, get our get up changed too. That's one of the things we need to do. Hey, you want to hit on this? A little temple chairs and a cocktail with some Nepalese munga munga. Put that thing out, man. I can't see. Well, out, brother. It's good shit. Put it out, motherfucker. I'm warning you. Whoa, chill the fuck out. Firstly, you are a real buzz killer, amigo. And secondly, I never made love to my mother. She wouldn't. And thirdly, we're in this together, so be cool. Sorry, man. I just don't drive when I'm fake. Is there any more dialogues? Are we good? I think we're good. Oh, look at those. This is the place. Whoa, Jesus, dude. Looks like you've been fed a bummer. That's okay. That's okay, my man. We have made it here. Kind of have a look here. What are these areas? Um, this is like property that we can't buy right now. We have a gym. Um, where's our clothing store? Shit. So down here we see the clothing store. Maybe we'll unlock it in a bit. As uh, yeah, we need to we need to change our attire. You dropped the bomb on me. Hey Caesar, what up? I got the lowdown on smokes, yay. Where it is every Monday and Friday the cash leaves Los Santos for San Fierro. Then every Wednesday and Saturday a courier takes the yay back to Big Smoke. Okay, I keep an eye out for them. See if I can't spoil their little party. All right, man. It's CJ. What? It's all the way down there, so... Where is this sound? Um... Oh, maybe it's just, maybe it's, oh, that's the red. Where is the red thing coming from? Hmm. Oh, right here. Alright, we, we aren't going to do that. Forget that. It is way too far. Let's go in here. Let's see what quest we have. Mission. Wear flowers in your hair? Motherfucker! That mute asshole! That fucking snake without a tongue! Gave me this shithole instead of a pink slip! I must be the biggest fucking idiot in the whole fucking world! Holmes, take it easy. At least we're alive. Girl, friend, fellow traveler, relax, man. You're really killing my fucking vibe here. Well, I'm sorry I'm fucking up your vibe, old man. But I can't wait to get my hands on that mute and your bitch-ass cousin. My cousin? You're gonna diss my familia? My bad, man. I'm just pissed for all of us. I mean, look, we in a strange place. We got shit to our name. And for once, I try to make something work, this garage, and it ain't even a garage. Then make it into a garage. Oh, that's a great idea, sis. Won't you shut up? <laughs> you know what, Carl? You are a fucking idiot. Your whole life you wanted something for nothing. Now you've got something and you don't know what to do with it. We'll make it good enough. We'll help, right? We got your back, CJ. Come on, stop tripping, man. Both of you. Whoa, man, the energy here is fantastic. Oh. Yeah, uh, all right. But how am I find some good mechanics to work up in here, man? I know a few guys. Come with me, friend. They're good people, I swear it. Oh, man, I'm about to ride with this fool again. <laughs> Come on, man. There's these two guys I know. Used to work on marine engines. Till the mob bought their business over in Vice. Now they try and make ends meet by taking any old job. They're a little bit dull by their habit. But the smoke don't get in the way of their skills with an engine. We'll pick up Jethro first. Last I heard, he was working at a garage over in East Basin. 
All right, let's go, my man. And recruit some people. Hey, man, how you meet these dudes anyway? I met them at the 89th year of Year 11, apparently. Apparently? You know how it is, man. A field of tents, crazy-ass music, a quart of mescaline vodka, polar bears. Polar bears? Yeah, go figure. They were funny guys, man. Great sense of humor. He's crazy! Van Maui. A boy is down here. This here is Vietnamese gang territory. Tanang boys, shining razors, butterfly children. Watch yourself, dude. These cats are real serious. What am I way, people? Alright. Oh, there he is. Hey, Jethro. Hop in, man. I've landed you a real job. Hey there, Truth Dude. Oh, man. Do, do I owe you? Because I swear I paid for that weed, dude. No, man. We're good. I think. Jethro, Carl. Carl, Jethro. What's up, man? Can we swing by the hospital? It's over in Santa Flora District. West of here. Yeah. You sick? No. The government is. But that's a long story. So, you know, like, what's the deal, dudes? I'm opening the garage in Doherty by the waste ground. You know, car mods, low riders, all that shit. You down? Do polar bears shit in the woods? No, but they've been known to shit in the liquor tent. If I remember <laughs> it, right? Yeah, that was like... So far gone. Our car's bust. Wonder if we can mod our car. I can't remember if we can. I cannot remember off the top of my head. Put all here. I don't know what the hell this guy wanted to do here. What we here for anyway? Nothing. Oh, don't look. Cover your faces. Think about a yellow rubber duck. You tripping again. Shh. Okay. I've seen enough. Let's go see if we can find Wayne. He's working a hot dog van at the tram terminal in Kings. Come on, dude. What's all that about? You don't want to know. Why? Do you know what a subdermal neurophone is? A what? Exactly. Sometimes it's best to stay in the dark, kid. This guy knows some crazy shit. Oh, yeah, he does know some crazy shit. I remember some things we're going to do with him. Um, right here. Dude, Dwayne. Man, how's the hot dog business? It's totally shit. Why? What's happening? Uh, my friend Carl here is opening a chop shop. Jethro's in. How about you? Uh, yeah, cool, man. Uh, I've got like some shit to take care of first, though. So, uh, you tell me where you guys are gonna be at and I'll meet you dudes there. The garage is on the waste grounds in Doherty. I'll see y'all later. Okay, next stop, cop station downtown. What? You watch your mom. Why? If I told you, the likelihood is you'd get a probe up your ass within a month. Like, listen to the man, dude. He's real serious about that shit. Well, okay. But you're starting to freak me out with all that spaceship, man. Alright, truth, my dude. We are here at the police station. Okay. You know the drill. Don't look interested in anything. Picture a pink golf ball in your mind. Okay, we're good to go. Where to next, spacehead? There's an electronics guy I've had dealings with. Goes by the name of Zero. He could fix a supercomputer with a paperclip. He's got his own shop, but he's always ready to help fellow travelers along the path. Let's go introduce you to him. Look, what's going on, True? Look, what's going on, True? Who was him do? Don't go there, man. Listen to Jethro. Now, what if I told you we never went to the moon? JFK lives in Scotland with Janis Joplin. And the only reason we've been in a Cold War for the last 45 years was because snake-headed aliens run the oil business. I think you popped another micro dot. Good. Keep it that way. Oh, I remember Zero now. Uh, we are at his place here. Leave me alone, Berkeley. This is stalking. Oh, hey, Truth. Get in. I'll fill you in as we drive. Home, James. 
Carl, zero. Zero, Carl. Sir. Carl here is open in the garage around the corner. I told him you're the man to speak to when it comes to electronics. <laughs> Actually, I'm the only man to speak to. <laughs> Grade A tip-top genius. That's me. You should drop by the shop sometime. See some of my shit, bro. I'll do that. Let's see here. We got the crew coming together. Oh. Well, the hot dog guy's here, too. Okay, we here. What the hell was this? <laughs> A week of hard work, and we'll transform this place. Hey, Caesar, come over here. What's up, B? Caesar, this Jethro, Dwayne, and Zero. Hey, man. Dude. Salutations, my sibling. Orale, let's get to work. Hey, hey, Carl, look. I think I found a way for us to get paid. I ain't going to no college to study no account. No, idiot. Property. Decorating ain't exactly my thing either. No, property development. Look, you buy a dump like this, fix it up, and sell it. Or better yet, you turn the property into a business. The snowball gets bigger. I don't know, sis. This all sound big time to me. Look, Carl, this place is going to get on its feet. And when it does, we are going to have money. If you want to make something of yourself, you got to let your money work for you. Look. I wouldn't even know where to start. Look, you two concentrate on the garage and let me work the property thing, okay? Yeah, that's my baby girl right there, Holmes. <laughs> Man, you chose her. I'm stuck with it. <laughs> Let's save here. Man, do we know where the clothing shop... Oh, yeah, we do. Guys, we gotta... Gotta go get some new clothing here. All right, so we got our guys look a little bit changed up. So we'll begin the next quest here. Mission. 555, five, five, we kip. It's fucked up. I can honestly say I wish you was here. Great. Now you got the present for that friend of mine, right? You know, the one trying to get me and old officer Pulaski into trouble? Yeah. Why don't you put that up in his car and give we tip a call? Hey, motherfucker, the code of the streets is that I don't snitch. I don't give a fuck if it kills you, me, my brother. Street cats don't call no cops. Carl, he's a DA. Oh, uh, yeah? Well, where I go find him? He's at the Van Kampf Hotel in the financial. Oh, for sure. <laughs> the DA is on his way to Van Kampf in downtown Sanford. Get over there now. Okay. Hmm. We don't have, uh... Did we just put it in our pocket or what? Crazy asshole, eh? Alright, let's go down there. Alright, we are right here. See this. This hotel operates valve service. The DA will be dropping his car off. Alright, my man, are you gonna go or what? Guy is just to find me. You little punk. Oh. Alright, we got him. Look like a velvet. Let's go. So we gotta get to the car board and wait. Financial. We in the financial. The text is so bad in this game. Like, uh, so that's like a bad. Ah, you must be the new boy. Get in line. We are the new boy. The DA is driving a blue mare. Remember, you'll need to identify it correctly. Make sure none of the other velvets uh, services his car. Okay. All right, that's the car. Oh, uh, one of you guys can go grab it. Go ahead, my man. 
We are gonna just uh, wait here. I believe this is his car. Parker over there. I think it is, right? Oh, idiot. This weather makes me wanna cry. What the hell, man? This cop absolutely hammered us. Okay, we have to go. Oh shit, we got a little bit of a distance to go here. And we got a... I don't know why. Well, actually, maybe because of the cameras and stuff. They wanna... They wanna cover their tracks. So... Oh, we're going back. We're gonna put in the drugs. And then we're gonna take the car back to him. Oh, okay. So that was... That was kind of the plan the whole time. But a man, boys! Drugs are planted. Take the car to the velvet. Okay. In the parking spot. Okay. It's coming. Velvet. Uh, velvet is coming to return the DS car outside. Okay. Let's go upstairs and uh, let's call. The wee tip, right? That's what it's called. The wee tip. Run, my man. My man is tired. All right, right here. He's wearing sunglasses. Hello, <laughs> this wee tip. I seen some highly suspicious. You should come check out. Do you know who you're fucking with here? I'll have your badge, you moron. Shut up! You find anything back there? Found anything? He's got half of Mexico in here. Must be two <laughs> tons of Mary here. What? But but I've never seen. How could it be? Hell of a defense you got there, buddy. Boom. Oh, slap. Man, be slap. Mission paste. Yo, my man. Enter a marker of velvet carpet. Oh, okay, so. Want to make some side dough? We obviously can. You don't look like you need this. Yeah, I definitely don't need it, my man. We gonna go back. And do some more missions here. Okay, let me get out here. We're probably gonna get a phone call. Of course. See, I knew it. Hey, Caesar. The yay leaving San Fierro, right? Right, but they're using bikes, CJ, and they go cross country. Okay, I'm gonna see what I can dig up. I mean, I wonder if it really does anything. Honestly, I don't think it does. Um, it keeps telling us to go after the yay. Oh, oh this is another area. That's the other area we gotta go to. Um, but I don't recall. The bleep are these guys? Like these little red dots are so hard to spot sometimes. Maybe they're already gone. Or maybe they're over here. Um, let me see. Uh, CJ, what way are we gonna look? That way, CJ. Okay. So CJ is looking this way. Where are these guys? Buddy, how? Huh? Oh, they're right there. Yeah, I forget it, man. My man's singing. Deconstruction. Hey, homies. That's like up, George girl? Lopez. What the fuck is going on? Do I look like a hooker to you? What? The Keep saying shit to me. Who said this to you? Fucking structure workers up that hill. I'ma fuck them up. Nah, hold up. I got this. I need to go teach him a little respect. Huh? That's right. Yeah. I've been thinking about getting me some new land anyway. <laughs> so 
Get out of the construction firm. Okay. Destroy all the portable and kill the form. Construction machinery will help destroy portable. Alrighty, let us go. You need a bulldozer. Did we do, my man? Did we do? Um, this is the bulldozer, so. <laughs> we go with round two here. You want me to shoot through my nail gun? You blind, buddy? Why can't we just use the explosive barrel then? Oh my god. I don't want to be another crime statistic. Oh, we got a certain time frame. Oh, wow. This time we didn't blow up. Okay. Um, let's see. Uh, we have this to blow up. My man. Yo, fire truck, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, we got more. Over oh, we got like, we gotta be careful with that one. Man wants to battle me, eh? Go trick yourself, my man. And we got one more over there. And then we have to kill the foreman. Oh. What's all that damn clatter? Holy crap, I didn't see nothing. Oh, push the mobile into the ditch. Okay. Um. Uh, Seems good enough then, huh? So we have to go this way. What is that? Alright, we gotta push this. Oh god, no! Oh god, oh, I'm gonna blow! Okay, we gotta go get this. Oh, this guy right here, he's really starting to piss me off right now. Alright, forget this. These guys are... Man, gonna get buried alive. I mean, like, at this point, when we shoved it down there, he should have got up and started running. Oh, okay, let's get out of here. What is this symbol here? Um, let's save here. Yeah, what? Yo, man! It's Jethro, dude! Hey, Jethro, what up? Well, I was talking to Caesar, and, uh, don't get me wrong, dude. I mean, you are one out there dude when it comes to driving, man. But Caesar, he told us how many cars you get through, dude. And me and Dwayne were like, whoa! What is your point, Jethro? No, no point, man, no point. Just that there's an advanced driving school, like, 
just up the road from the garage, man. Like in Doherty. Driving school? Man, exactly what you trying to say, man. Nothing, man, nothing. It was Dwayne's idea. I think you're, you know, cool and shit. I, I better go, CJ. I'll see you later. Okay, what do we got here? CJ. You got it? Hey, my cousin just called me. He gave me a tip about a baller's car going to San Fierro to score yay. Shit. We gotta find out who's supplying those cats. Read your mind, Holmes. I picked them up at the Maholan intersection, and I'm trailing them now. Okay, I'm coming to meet you. Better make it fast, Holmes. These boys are hanging around. You don't want to die, do you? Let us go. Let us go. Let us go. Uh, where? Where do we? Wait, where is this guy? Oh, we got a long way to go here. Right? Like... Bloody all the way across there. Alright guys, we will meet y'all there. Because uh, we got quite a... Little bit of a ride there. And we gonna go find out what baller motherfucker is... Uh, Raiding this havoc for us. All right, we arrived at the location here. Um, so right over here, what's CJ doing? Caesar doing here? My man Caesar. Happy Holmes. Are you gonna let me drive? Let me drive this nice car here. Where we going? Then we oh, about hold on a second here. Let's move that. Wait, follow the road and maybe we can pick them up. My, my bad, man. I wonder I need to go to driving school. Okay, where are they? Why am I so blind here? I kind of have to look. Where the bloody hell are they? These are came this way. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm just blind. Forget it. Yeah, we're just gonna follow the path. Let's go, my main. Should we go off road? Oh no, there's the path now. Oh, they're all the way over here. Okay. And now it's like showing us the path. What the hell? Gotta do that before. Ready? Uh, we have arrived here. So this is back to where we kind of, where Officer Tenpenny and all those guys kind of abandoned us. Get to the rooftop, okay? Let's go, Caesar. Okay, where to the rooftop? Right here. Okay, we can get there on our own. So. What are we kind of looking at here? Photograph the face of each target. There yeah. it is, Holmes. Ryder. Right. You sure, man. This business is bigger than any gang, is it? Ryder, little bitch. Oh, that's his boy, that essay. This guy take himself real serious. That's T-Bone Mendez. What now? Is that it? Ain't nobody can hey, who's him. the gringo? I don't like the look of that guy. This more than a few thugs pushing product. It's a serious organization. How many of these clowns are there? Ah, I know a pimp when I see one. They being <laughs> clever about this. It ain't no exchange of nothing incriminating. Man, he's gonna abandon us here, isn't he? Like, why don't you just take us back? That was some heavy shit. We better split up and get out of here. I'll meet you back at the garage, eh? Coolio, we got what we came for anyway. Oh, 
Oh, who knows what you might find out. Okay, so we gotta eventually head our way back to... Uh, what is S here? Hmm. It's like a dragon symbol here. Interest. Alright, guys. Uh, What we're gonna do is we are gonna end this episode here. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you.